Hello water signs, welcome back to my channel. This is Empress Bella and I am here to give you guys your weekend reading. This is for water signs, Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so the messages may or may not resonate with you. Take the messages that resonate with you and your personal situation and leave the rest water signs. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day so far. <clears throat> Let's see you guys, water signs, overall energy. For the water signs, okay, I'm hearing um, there's a ribbon in the sky for our love water signs. So maybe you're listening to that song, okay, or somebody's listening to that, okay, thinking about you. So water signs, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, what's the overall energy? <laughs> yeah, so we have the emperor energy, all right? This could be your husband. This could be your divine masculine that could be thinking about that, all right? Yeah. There's a divine masculine that is ready to see things your way. All right, word of science. So they're like, okay, I get it. You're right. I was wrong this weekend. So, yeah. <clears throat> word of science. Hi, everyone. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Word of science. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Power. So, yeah. Definitely. <laughs> the power of love. Oh, there's a ribbon in the sky for our love. Yes. I love it. The power of love is something else, right? Yeah, somebody could be wishing for you. Okay. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. You could be dealing with a Leo or Aries. Or you have those energies in your chart. So water signs. Let's see what's going on for you guys. Cancer, Pisces, and Scorpio. Okay, so now I'm hearing um, it could all be so simple, but you'd rather make it hard. All right, so, um, aw, what is that? Um, Lauren Hill, uh, I forgot the name of the song, but y'all know what I'm talking about. What are signs? What's going on for y'all? weekend so we got listening to advice here <laughs> yes loving you is like a battle okay it's the reason so somebody definitely is like the reason why okay something is happening here is because somebody has a lot of feelings for you and I feel like to lose you water sign it's a nightmare for somebody okay I don't know what had happened. Let's pull more cards here. Hello. Hi. Green Rising, everyone. Green Rising. So this person is definitely wants you to listen to reason here. Okay. If this person feel like they lost you, water signs, they want you back. Okay. Yeah. Life purpose here. All right, maybe you're very focused on your life purpose or your mission here, or this person feel like they want to spend their life with you. All right, but we got caution here. As soon as I say that, life with you, mirror energy. So this could be like a twin flame connection, but don't have to be. Um, I feel like y'all both are experiencing similar energies here, self reflection. All right. So take a moment to reflect here. Ooh, evil eye. All right. So balancing something out. Somebody could be like wishing or wished ill will. All right. Self-reflection here. Caution, life purpose. Okay. So, hmm. If somebody's wishing ill will or something like that on you guys or on this connection or on your person or whatever. Um, it's going to be mirrored back to them here. They need to be cautious because somebody is is in their life purpose. So be mindful what energy you're projecting at someone, whether you like it or not. Okay. I don't know. If you are in your life purpose, okay, water sign, somebody could be projecting negative energy to you, but it's going to be reflected back to them. So, yeah. Let's see here. Nine of Cups. So be patient. I feel like you definitely are going to get some sort of wish fulfillment. 
All right, but definitely somebody's in their life purpose here. Be mindful what you are projecting at someone. Because it looks like somebody's alone, but they're not. So that's their ancestors and ascended masters and stuff like that. Just know something, whatever it is, will be married back to someone. That's what I'm that's the message I'm hearing for somebody. See here. So all evil eyes are going blind right now. So yeah. This person could be wishing out on you. It's like you don't if you're not with me, you know, I'm hearing Capricorn. Could be dealing with a Capricorn or somebody with very like toxic ways or something. Gemini energy. This could be some uh, making a choice here and a lover here. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Double Capricorn with the Four of Pentacles and the Devil. Okay. Somebody chooses possession and control over maybe love. All right. Or that's what they want. They want control over you, water sign, and you're not having it. So let's see. It's coming towards you guys this weekend. All right. So we got the Eight of Swords. So somebody feels stuck here, planning something. They could be all in their head if this is going to work out. Okay. Yeah. Seven of Wands. Wow. Because somebody could be very defensive or have defended themselves. Because, yeah. I've also I heard in court too. So something could be about a divorce or court or something like that. Um. Damn. How does this person plan on coming towards you? Six of Swords wanting to move to more common waters. Could be a Libra. All right. They want to move to more common waters with you. They don't want to fight. They don't want to argue. Something like that. This person, you could be looking at this person as a liar or cheater, manipulator or something like that. You could be a divine feminine. All right. And this could be your masculine or your husband. I want to say ex-husband. All right. Yeah, they've been awakening here because something came to light here. Yeah, and they're going to have to defend themselves about a third party. Or they're going to be left out in the cold from something. It's like they want to explain. Okay, let me explain. Energy is what I'm getting right now. What's the obstacle right now for you guys? All right. The damn Ten of Wands. Wow, something is... It's going to be tough. It's going to be a struggle here. Or something is heavy because of the Ace of Pentacles. Maybe to get this money or... Um... It's a struggle. It's a challenge. It's going to be a lot of work to get this Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, and a brand new cycle because you already know something. Yeah, they waiting for something to end or you waiting for somebody lies to backfire. Like, so you may not trust somebody, water signs. Yeah. <clears throat> What's the outcome? The moon. Pisces. So, hmm. Yeah, King of Pentacles. So, I feel like... <clears throat> Excuse me. Either you're afraid of this King of Pentacles or this King of Pentacles is nervous that you're not dealing with them no more. Like I said, this could be your husband, uh, baby father, whatever this is, okay, or just the earth sign. But let's see. It's things, a lot of things hidden. Also, somebody could be high in the fact there that they married. That's what I was about to say. So somebody could be high in the fact that they were married here or dealing with someone else or something like that. Let's say the swords. Knight of Pentacles. So somebody feels stuck. Virgo energy. Uh, they feel like things ain't not going to move forward with the Empress. Or they taking a long time to get towards this Empress here. Somebody all in their head overthinking. Should they stop coming towards this Empress or not? What is this Knight of Pentacles here? The Five of Swords. So somebody definitely may self-sabotage themselves here. Queen of Wands. Uh, I feel like somebody wants to win at all costs here as well. Somebody that could be, this Queen of Wands could have lied about something. Maybe they were really waiting for something to end here. It could be a fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sage. But the Five of Swords is somebody wanting to win at all costs here in some way. So they could even go as far as lying on you or someone. So somebody can stop going towards you or towards the Empress. What is the five of swords here? But somebody wants to win at all costs here. The nine of wands. Yeah, and they don't want to give up here. Yeah. 
but they're going to regret it if they don't. Nine of Wands. I feel like somebody is definitely believing that somebody is going to lose. Like, they're going to lose. Like, I just know it. Right? Yeah. The Ace of Cups. Oh, my. Queen of Wands. Four freaking... Wow. Yeah, somebody wants somebody to lose this. Ace of Cups. Four of Wands. Queen of Pentacles. Like... Somebody doesn't want somebody to either be in this marriage or relationship or whatever. They could be sending ill will or negative intent towards y'all relationship with somebody. Um, but somebody does not want to give up. They want to sabotage something by slowing somebody down, okay, to the point where it's like they're barely moving at all. Maybe so an empress could be like, okay, well, obviously it's not, you know. But in all actuality, somebody wants to step into their life purpose or step into this connection the right way. But... There's obstacles here. Nine of Wands. Somebody may be the Wounded Warrior. What's the Nine of Wands here? Yeah, Enlightenment. Okay, so I definitely could be going through Awakening. That somebody is single and abundant with or without anyone. Somebody alone is abundant right now. Nine of Pentacles. All right, somebody's awakened to that. Yeah, and I feel like they definitely have options or a, a choice that they can choose to be with in a relationship or a marriage. And somebody going to miss an opportunity if they don't take some sort of action. Maybe because they're taking action, if they show, if they, if they, they could be juggling it. Like, should I work with this person? Should I not? I don't know. They're going to wind up missing their damn boat fucking around. Okay, that's probably why this that moon was there. All right. What's the six of swords here? How they coming towards you is one to move to more common waters or traveling. Somebody may be at a distance. Six of Swords. This is Six of Swords. Thank you. The Tower and the Page of Swords. So somebody wants to move to more common waters, but there is going to be some sort of tower or abrupt shift or change after some information come out with the Page of Swords. Somebody may be spying on someone to see if they brought a tower here. Somebody literally is waiting for something to end. All right. So somebody is moving to more common waters, which is shocking someone that's spying on you. Could be a Gemini. Like, how is this possible? Okay. What's this page of swords here? They're having a tower moment here to see that somebody is moving forward here. Ten of swords. Ace of wands. Ace of cups. Judgment. So I feel like. Somebody is feeling some type of way because you're moving forward, water signs. Okay? Like, they had every... They just knew that you were going to miss something that was for you. They just knew it. Ten of Wands, it was too much of a struggle or a burden here. What's the Ten of Wands here? So, you got two Tens. Ten of Swords and Ten of Wands is the worst tens in the deck, but they are also completion. So something is completed here. Two of Swords here. Yeah, this is what they did not see, that it was going to be too much work or a struggle. Yeah, for this Emperor here. The Emperor could have went within here. All right, is in Hermit here looking at their, their money, their Ten of Pentacles here. I feel like somebody is maybe was confused or... Tried to cause some sort of illusion that they missed the opportunity to take action and heal something, ten of cups. But they see the truth now that somebody just was trying to cause conflict in the past with their two of cups. So somebody like, oh hell no. Like so somebody like, yeah, I actually can move forward. I can, you know, um, but somebody else was waiting for somebody not to do anything. And they already did something. So something is moving forward. All right, like what kind of shit? This is what somebody didn't um Wow, okay, but they feel some type of way. Ten of Swords about that. That somebody, it, it was going to be too much work for somebody to be closed off or cause a stalemate. Listen to a Swords. Yeah, to somebody reconciling or making a judgment call on this contract here or with this Capricorn is in regret because there's a King of Pentacles that is fighting for this. They going to fight for whatever they want, whatever this is, this connection. All right, somebody want to fight for this. They want to be with you or they want to be with whomever this is. Okay, yes, the Queen of Cups. That's it. They made a decision, five of wands. Yeah, to fight for this. They know that there was a Queen of Cups that could have been trying to cause conflict to them making a decision. Okay, could have been a Cancer, a Pisces, or a Scorpio. But I feel like they're making a judgment on love because love is the pow most powerful energy, right? So somebody is doing this out of love here. 
okay? And they listening to advice here about getting into their life purpose or which they could have been afraid to do, but somebody's going to do it. What's the moon? So things are hidden right now. What's the moon, please? Yeah, Queen of Swords. So somebody, things were hidden here. Yeah, the Queen of Swords could have been about to, preparing to receive something here. Or they're afraid maybe this Queen of Swords here, or they had illusions about the Queen of Swords, was going to wait for something. Or what's the Queen of Swords here? Four of Pentacles here. All right, Emperor. So I feel like somebody was an illusion that the Queen of Swords was going to hold back from their Emperor. I don't know why. But somebody really thought that, okay, or they was going to hold back or try to control something, you know, okay. Um, what's the four of pentacles here? I really feel like somebody is so focused on, yeah, the queen of pentacles. So ace of pentacles. Um, and the Ten of Damn Cups. Wow. So, somebody loves themselves enough here. Somebody, this is definitely a gift. Ace of Pentacles, Ten of Cups here. Somebody about to be real happy. The truth is, yeah, somebody could have walked away. All right. From something they was invested in to make an offer to someone. All right. And that's what's happening right now. Um, yeah, but they're holding back from a earth sign, a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn. It's three women here. Or they're holding back from this Capricorn and Sag energy. Because this could be a Capricorn or a Sag. But I feel like this is double Capricorn again. Remember, I was saying that. Somebody definitely was trying to control or possess something here. Or they're definitely... Somebody was in the illusion that the Queen of Swords was going to hold back from loving herself. Or being a wife or something like that. Alright, so... Maybe somebody thought somebody was going to be single forever. That could be a, a, a thing, too. Somebody's not happy about that, I tell you that much. Or from being a mother. Like some of you guys could be pregnant. Congratulations. Okay. Water signs. But let's see. That's why somebody is upset or angry or feeling some type of way. Because somebody's being, it's like going into their life purpose. But somebody does not like that. Alright. Yeah, it could be. A, yeah, and a third party is over. Yeah. They don't, there's no third parties here with this situation. Yeah, I'm here. All I want is you. Okay. So somebody, all they want is the water sign. We got white man or woman here. It's your time to enjoy. Somebody all in their head and their feelings. Could be a Scorpio here. <clears throat> I got to make it up to you this lifetime. Absolutely. We got Z. 48 hours. We got in an ex is stalking or watching you here. They's planning to rob the plan to rob you fell. Okay. You got WAP in the reverse here, but why can't I find someone like you? You, we got new love here. Somebody is definitely physically or verbally abusive because somebody is yeah, about to be a leader here. Okay, moving forward. Somebody's getting in their leadership position. So an emperor is in their power now. Okay. Somebody got a red card here. A cancer. This person could be selling sex or porn or some shit like that. 777. Um, or that's what they said about this person. A Sagittarius. Uh, 777, um, y'all on y'all way to, uh, achieving y'all success. We got why. I feel so bad for what I've done. This man is being watched, G, by your mother. So a man is being watched by their mother, Aquarius. You are protected. Pay raise. So somebody money is protected, okay, as they move forward. Because they're going to be in their life purpose here. He or she was doing black magic. 
A, first layers, middle initial, um, emperor. Could be watching somebody. Let's see. What's the message for the water signs this weekend? Shortcut with the waves. K. Okay. Return the sender 10 times 10. Lord have mercy. What happened? So what they did, they said somebody was doing black magic, a karmic woman. It's being returned to sender here. We got Virgo. We got C. So somebody is shook or is in fear now because positive changes is happening. Somebody know they messed up bad. Okay. And it was a suicide mission. Everybody been court. Yeah, because this is true love. Y'all going to get married to this person, water signs, okay? And it's a soul contract you have with someone. And somebody doesn't like that, that you have a soul contract with this new love. And maybe they thought that you wasn't going to move forward or I don't know. But yeah, I hope this helped you guys. Sending you guys an abundance of love, light, and hella vibes. And I will talk to you guys later.